All right, now we're gonna talk about hip throws and one of the most underutilized, underappreciated elements of mixed martial arts is really coming in now uh, with Ronda Rousey and some other fighters, judo. Using judo in cage fighting. If you look at Frank Mir versus Roy Nelson as a fight a while ago, look it up, you can see he, Frank did not want to shoot on Nelson because Nelson's big. So what did he do? He used judo. Judo is great because you don't have to change level. I'm not saying one art has been another, but it's just a great option. I'm gonna start with the basic footwork of the hip throw. Okay, just, uh, my, just stand my thing. Okay. Right, okay, guys, so step, step. Not one step like wrestlers do, all right? It's not wrong, but you're gonna get more power. Step, pivot. Okay, see that? Step, pivot. Step, pivot. Step, pivot. That's the footwork. Now, I'm in the clinch. Okay, it's easy, you can throw it from here, but easier, punch him, get over here. Step, step, pivot, hip throw. Okay, sorry, but you, you okay? Chad, Chad's gonna go now, he's gonna punch up. Step, pivot, throw, right there. One more time, here, punch. Watch the footwork, step. Step, pivot. Okay, hip throw. Oh, goshi. Great judo throw. Now, one thing you wanna not be careful to do is this throw here. Koshi Guruma, good throw, but if you mess it up, he's gonna get your back. Okay, and that's bad. So, I prefer to hit it from here. Now, is this wrong? It's not wrong, but you better hold tight you better hold tight, otherwise this happens, chat, suplex. I go here, I mess up. Uh! Yeah. So, use the underhook, all right? Hip throw. Hip throw.